Hello guys and welcome to another episode brought to you by Game Glitches. I just wanted to show you guys where you could obtain one of the most powerful companions in early game. This, he's a saucer and uh, he really is an interesting character, so to speak. You will see what I'm talking about. I found him by merely following that blood trail. If you look at the map, he's located here. Basically, when you enter from the bottom first time, he is in the middle, that the building in the center. You go to the second floor, and he is right here. Can I help you? I'm not gonna go fast, so you guys could, you know, could read this a little bit at least. And he basically uh, tells you that you will never could deal with evil things, you know. And if you do, you're gonna, well, he's gonna either, you know, backstab you or just bounce. And when you agree... Voila, you get yourself a new companion. Now let's look at his spell. He has throw an item and character up high and drop it for 39 to 48 damage. What's up? Now let's take a look at his abilities. Uh, throw an item or a character up high and drop it on the ground dealing 39 40 crushing damage. Meaning you could do this to barrels, items or mobs and characters and crushing damage is very hard to resist. Uh, this one magical claw dealing 22 to 27 air damage. Uh, chance to uh, set blind status 35%. Uh, this one is 100% uh, uh, chilled status. Uh, this one is the other one on uh, my saucer. It's a practically equivalent. It is equivalent. Uh, this one is Blitz Bolt, shot a bolt of electricity that deals 26 to 28 air damage. Then you have uh, Create Water Surface, 100% wet status. And then we have Heal Vitality on the target over three turns. So he is basically a very nice DPS and a healer. Let's take a look how his spells look. Can I help you? Oh, yeah, that's what happens when you destroy her furnace. She gets mad. Farewell. All right, let's see what else we got. <laughs> very interesting class and he is very fun to play I hope you guys enjoyed this video and uh, the last thing I actually wanted to show you guys just is inventory, uh, the items that he starts with, that he is actually level 3 versus, you know, me being level 2 and such, so he's a great jump. And he got decent items for his level. Well, and these are his stats. Resistances, uh, HP. A brief history of sorcery still hasn't been returned. Theron will have to pay yet another fine. 
and these are his traits. Please note that we're playing a campaign. Uh, this is not some modded version. And well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and see you next time. Please subscribe. Thank you.